Um, I am Dr. Sibilia Felicen, and I will be presenting our paper titled Job Performance and Emotional Intelligence Among LPU Administrative Personnel. Emotional intelligence involves one's perception of others or when to understand how others feel. Emotional intelligence manages relationship more effectively. While job performance is a set of behaviors that person does or does not perform or is a performance and result of those behavior. It is the value of the set of employee behaviors that contribute either positively or negatively to organizational goal accomplishment. Job performance is an issue that has not only graphs companies all over the world, but also fueled a great deal, deal of research in the field of management, occupational health, work, and organizational psychology. In the case of LPU, the job performance of employees is measured in the delivery of their jobs <clears throat> toward the realization of the university vision, mission, and core values. For the objectives of the study, first, present the profile of the LPU personnel in terms of age, sex, civil status, level of education, and number of years in service. Second, determine the job performance of the LPU personnel. Third, assess the emotional intelligence of the personnel in terms of self-awareness, self-management, social awareness, and relationship management. Fourth, test the significant difference in the assessment of emotional intelligence when grouped according to profile. And last, test the relationship between job performance and emotional intelligence of LPU personnel. Daniel Goldman's emotional intelligence was developed for a five elements that define emotional intelligence, such as self-awareness, self-regulation, motivation, empathy, and social skills. This is associated with the emotional intelligence in the workplace, such as self-awareness, self-management, social awareness, and relationship management. Self-awareness is, is recognized, is the ability to recognize an emotion as it happens. The major elements of self-awareness is emotional awareness and self-confidence. Self-manage, while well, self-management is the ability to regulate one's emotion, thoughts, and behaviors effectively in different situations. Self-awareness is the ability to take the perspective and empathize with others from diverse backgrounds and culture, to understand, so, to understand social and ethical norms for behavior, and to recognize family, school, and community resources, and so on. While relationship management is the ability to get the best of others, to inspire and influence others, communicate and build bonds with them, ability to help them change, grow, develop, and resolve conflict. This study um, is a descriptive correlation or use descriptive correlation design to determine the relationship between job performance and emotional intelligence among LPU personnel. The participants of the study are 67 employees or 100% regular employees. The instrument used was a standard questionnaire by Management Performance Solution Limited, which also used documentary analysis to determine the job performance of employees using the performance evaluation of year 2016-2017. Interview was also uh, used or done to conduct um, to have a substantiate result of the study. For the procedure, data gathering was personally, personally administered by the researcher. For the data analysis, frequency distribution, percentage ranking, weighted mean, person R moment product correlation was used. For data privacy purposes, the survey forms were coded and names were withheld before rating scores were encoded. 
To answer objective number one, present the profile of the personnel. In terms of age, 31 to 40 years old are majority of the respondents. In terms of sex, female are my majority of the respondents or majority of the employees of LPU are female. When it comes to civil status, majority of them are married. In terms of highest educational attainment, majority of the respondents are college degree with 41% or 28 employees. When it comes to number of years in service in LPU, below five years and 11, 15 years, rank first with 2.25.40. To answer objective number two, determine the job performance of LPU personnel. This shows that um, majority of the respondents have a rating of 92, 93 or above average. They are 33 or 49.25% with the overall performance of 91.01%. For objective, to answer objective three, assess the emotional intelligence of LPU personnel, I will be presenting only the top three indicators among the 10 indicators or questions. In terms of self-awareness, acting confidently when I have some relevant expertise, top on the rank, followed by managing how much pressure I put myself, and third, sharing with others when I am uneasy about taking on tasks. The administrative personnel feel confident if they are an expert in their job or they possess enough experience to handle their job. They can easily accomplish their task and they can be proud of themselves for having such achievement. In terms of self-management, rank first tackling obstacles and problems rather than simply complaining about them, followed by initiating action on tasks without needing to be asked, and third, adjusting rapidly when the situation changes. Emotionally intelligent individuals are facing the problem in order to solve instead of complaining on what to do with the situation. This is a positive attitude that makes them at par with other colleagues. In terms of social awareness, top on the rank is anticipating customer needs followed by addressing the needs and concern of others. And third, alerting others when the harmony within the group is under strain. Employees are socially aware if they, are already, if they already anticipate the need of their customers. This means that employees are already abreast with their job in such a way that they already know the needs of the customers. In terms of relationship management or social skills, rank first is listening attentively, followed by supporting others in their learning and development, and third, presenting ideas in a way that engages others and inspire, inspire them to achieve more. Being attentive in listening to the needs of the customers and co-workers co makes an individual responsible in dealing with others. Each person should take some time to listen without interrupting the others or person or other person who talks. For objective number four, test the significant difference on the emotion on on the emotional intelligence, I will be presenting only those um, indicators with significant difference result. In terms of social awareness, only age and number of years in LPU are found to be significant. The results suggest that administrative personnel, uh, when they get older and serve LPU for long years in the institution, their emotional intelligence goes up or they become more mature. The result is consistent with the age and number of years in LPU. 
in terms of social skills or relationship management, only civil status and number of years in LPU found to be significant. This means that the widow has higher level of emotional skills because they went through a lot of emotional stress and therefore easily get along with their colleagues and customers and their number of years of experience as employees contributed to their maturity to handle positive view. When it comes to the relationship between job performance and emotional intelligence, the study shows that um, there's no significant difference between job performance and emotional intelligence. This means that whether the employee has high rating in their job performance or awarded as outstanding or top performing employees, emotional intelligence such as self-awareness, self-management, social awareness, relationship management does not contribute to their achievement. Conclude, majority of the respondents are 31 to 40 years old, female, married, with college degree and serving LPU for 11 to 15 years. Majority of the administrative personnel's job performance rating is on above average level. The administrative personnel can frequently manage their emotional intelligence as to social skills, self-management, social awareness, and self-awareness. Significant difference found in the assessment of social awareness and social skills when grouped according to number of years in the university. It is recommended that through the HRMD or learning calendar, seminar or workshop about emotional intelligence may be included to improve employee self-awareness and knowledge to know how to manage their emotional intelligence. Encourage employees to join quality circle groups of the university as an avenue in developing social skills. Another recommendation is to continue supporting and identify learning needs of employees via training and other modes of skills development to enhance their expertise on their work and be and and be perf and perform their work to superior level. All employees may join the community extension and outreach program of the university to enhance employee interaction and social networking leading to extroversion. Another, the HR or Human Resource Department may recommend to the management to enhance the reward package to or for employees with above average performance by re recommending additional benefits in the existing ones. Employees may commend the management for the continued support for the development of ex employee expertise in order for them to deliver their task confidently. Another is employees may be provided orientation in solving problems that may occur in the de delivery of tasks as specified in their job description. Other interested employees may conduct future study using other variables not covered by this study to give more in-depth analysis on emotional intelligence and job performance. Thank you very much. Thank you. Sorry. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, Dr. Sivela, can you turn on the video, please? So I can snap the shot and keep as a link code. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, any participant, do you have do do you have any question? Would like to ask or share some ideas with uh, the researcher? Seem like no. Okay, uh, actually, I also uh, in. Emotion intelligence also really important in in current situations, especially during you have more tension about those kind of COVID nineteen situations. A lot of people see with tension. You, if you able to manage your emotion, that would be good. 
Ajanim, do you have any question or any idea you would like to exchange? Ajanim, you need to. Thank you very much. Okay. Ajanim, you need to then add, uh, unmute your microphone. Yes. Thank you. This topic is very interesting, but I have no idea uh, about the thing that your uh, research scholars uh, have that contribute to anyone. Okay. okay. Uh, thank you, Dr. Sivela, and thank you, Ajahn Nim. Okay. 